Well, Taylor Swift's fanatic supporters get a second chance to shake it off with the pop star in Adelaide tonight. Eddie Godfrey joins us now live from the Entertainment Centre. And Eddie, excitement has been building all day. It sure has, Kate, and there's not long to go until Taylor Swift takes to the stage here at the Adelaide Entertainment Centre for her second and final Adelaide show. Lots of fans have been arriving here in the last half an hour or so. They're waiting to go in. The merchandise stand has been very busy also. There's a dedicated group of fans who've been waiting at the back of the Entertainment Centre for several hours, hoping to catch a glimpse of arguably the world's biggest pop star. And they're not the only ones who have been hoping to do that. You can hear some excited fans here at the moment. Some fans also have been waiting outside her city hotel this afternoon, also hoping to catch a glimpse of the global superstar. And there were some exciting moments when they thought they spotted her through a window on the very top level. But they didn't get to meet her, but that didn't dampen their excitement. Oh, um, just... We're waiting for like anyone, yeah. even like just dancers, yeah, we saw the dancers backup singers, but, like especially Taylor. Yeah. But... Yeah. Yeah. Oh, we want to meet family, like yeah. her mum's here and her brother and stuff, so we want to meet them hopefully. Now while they didn't get to meet her unfortunately, a young girl from the Sunshine Coast did. 12 year old Ella Sinclair suffers with cystic fibrosis, it's been her dream to meet Taylor Swift and she got the opportunity last night thanks to a huge social media campaign and Taylor Swift herself, who flew her down from Brisbane. Um, so I walked in and she gave me a big hug and then she said I looked lovely and she said thank you for wearing my face on, my sh on your shirt. But then she said I was an inspiration and I said she was an inspiration too. But she was such a lovely lady and she was so kind and she was just amazing to talk to. <laughs> So a very happy 12-year-old Ella Sinclair there with the chance to meet her hero. Last night's concert was very well received. There were some great reviews about that concert and no doubt fans tonight will be treated to something just as special.